Hi. I've been asked to do a tutorial on cleaning up a computer using CCleaner. So this is only for PCs. First going to do downloading it. So if we go to ccleaner.com I'll put the link in the sidebar. Go to download download from file hippo and download latest version. I'm using Firefox which just saves the file. If you're using Internet Explorer you've got the choice of downloading it or running it. When it's downloaded double click on the installer package. You'll get this window up you can select different languages quite easy. Agree to the license agreement. Now I usually untick this unless you want Yahoo toolbar on your browser. Leave it here, uh, untick it. That's installed. Nice, quick and easy. Now for setting it up. Unless you want to delete your shortcuts, leave that unticked. These ones just click OK to. This white free space here is very handy and I would recommend using it at least once. What it does is wipe undelete information from your hard drive and gives you extra space. Once you've ticked, once you've ticked the boxes leaving desktop shortcuts and wipe free space unticked, go to options, then advanced, and untick these two. Close the program down and restart it again first thing to do is run cleaner. If you don't want this message up again, click on the box and it won't show it again. As you see, it's taken out 3.52 meg. Now, if you've never done a proper cleanup on your computer before, it's going to take out probably a gig, if not a couple of gigabytes of information that is not needed anymore. Then click on registry and scan for issues. What this does is look at your registry and see where each registry thing is pointing. If it's not pointing anywhere, i.e. it's a dead registry string, it will give you the option to delete it which speeds your machine up. As you see I've only got one here. Click on fix issues and fix issue. Close Keep doing this process, i.e. scan for issues and clear issues, or fix issues, until it comes up saying this, no issues were found. If you use this once a week, then your computer will run nicely and run as if it were new. You may say, OK John, this is one of these third party programs, what makes this so special? Well, this program is recommended by people like Microsoft, Fujitsu Siemens, Dell, HP, and if you go and get the latest copy of Windows Vista magazine, on the disk it always comes with a copy of this. I hope this helps. Thank you for watching.